Thousands of people across the country are marching for and against abortion tonight after the Supreme Court overturned Roe v. Wade. They gathered in places like New York, Detroit and Chicago. One abortion rights activist even climbed to the top of the Frederick Douglass Memorial Bridge in Washington, D.C. Nobody did anything like that here in southwest Florida, but hundreds of abortion rights activists protested in downtown Fort Myers tonight, along with some who were actually thrilled by the court's decision. So NBC2's Gage Golding was there alongside them all and has this report. Among all the demonstrators, there's one thing that we heard over and over again, almost like a broken record. I can't believe they actually did it. I can't believe they actually overturned Roe v. Wade. At the steps of the old Lee County Courthouse and echoing through the streets of downtown Fort Myers. I'm extremely pissed off about it. There was no way that it was actually really happening. Abortion rights activists voicing their thoughts on the reversal of Roe versus Wade. I immediately called my mom and started crying. It doesn't feel real. What is real is that abortion is no longer a constitutionally recognized right. This is a reproductive right that all women should, I mean, we should have access to this. In Florida, it's still legal to get an abortion before 24 weeks of pregnancy. But next week, that window whittles down to just 15 weeks. This is not going to be very long lived. That's why they're here, calling on lawmakers to keep Florida a free state of choice. If you don't like abortion, they don't have one. People who applaud the Supreme Court's decision were also here, albeit outnumbered 100 to 1. You don't have to go and stick a coat hanger in your uterus. You don't have to do that. What you need to do is be responsible. Undoubtedly, the day June 24, 2022 will be written as a new page in history books to come. The day a nearly 50-year-old decision died, but not without a fight. Reporting in downtown Fort Myers, Gage Golding, NBC2.